Hello everybody and I hope you're having a fantastic day and in this video I'm coming back at you with another spawn vid and this time we're going to be talking about the treasure spawn that just came out. I'm terribly sorry for not coming out with these videos earlier. I absolutely couldn't because I accidentally left my mouse for my uh, laptop at work and without my mouse I have literally genuinely like no access to my laptop so I couldn't make the videos then. But now I have my mouse back and now I can make these videos so now I can finally talk about the treasure spawn and the update and what's not that just came out okay so i have never in unison league see three boxes in my life when it goes to a treasure spot so that's very very interesting like you just see the ball zoned out here super small and then there are big boxes right here so that's very very interesting but anyways moving on from there let's take a look at this treasure spawn okay so this is a monster treasure spawn i was very happy that they came out with the monster treasure spawn again because i kind of missed it this was a very very nice concept except this time they destroyed the whole logic behind it legitimately uh the one i did allowed you to choose the summoning scroll of the monsters and what's not and they offered a lot of uh, treasure medals within the chest as well like 1000 jackpot 1000 side chest and then 500 in one of the side chests as well preferably i'd have 2000 the jackpot 1000 one of the side chests and then 500 the side chest but it's whatever or in fact if you really want to do this a team 2k in the jackpot and then 1k in the side chest and Legitimately, I would be a happy camper. I legitimately would be a happy camper if you had some scrolls and the metals were that um, pretty much uh, like in a prosperous state. Legitimately, I would be happy, but they didn't do that. In fact, it is even worse. I don't recommend touching this spot whatsoever. Okay, so let's actually get over. Let's actually go over. Okay, so they have no rates in the gear spawn whatsoever for the monsters. I mean, they do have them, but they're nearly mythical, so you're not going to be able to obtain them. And then they have this little ticket right here. Each time you spawn, you're getting one of these tickets. With two of these, you are able, guaranteed, to actually get another of the featured monsters from the list. So that's very, very nice. But anyways, moving on from there. For, this is first time half off for 50 gems, so pretty much after the first time, it's 100 gems. It's legitimately 100 gems. As you all know, if you, and if you don't know, if you're new to this channel, or this game in general, my bad, this game in general, when you go for the jackpot, you have really low rates on the summoning scroll. They say all these, they show all these summoning scrolls or the feature gear. If it was the summoning scrolls from the jackpot, by far, like only the summoning scrolls, by far, you would have had me sold already. But th it's not just the summoning scrolls. They have the feature gear in here as well. And you can bet your lucky uh, horseshoe or, or whatever you have that the feature gear is going to have significantly higher rates in the jackpot than the summoning scrolls will ever. And then you have a drop of Ether Awakening Ore. Personally, me, I'm going to stick to the special spawn when it comes to getting my Awakening Orbs and Ethers. I'm not about to get one Awakening Orb and one Ether for 100 gems when they offer them first time half off for 15 gems. And the special spawn, and then 30 gems after the first time half off in the special spawn. So I, I'm honestly going to save myself a lot of gems and not do that. And then on top of it, like, you're not guaranteed whatsoever when you spawn to actually get the jackpot to get a featured monster. That's going to be a random stats, and it's going to be a random monster. Like, every other spawn they have so far. SSR feature gear piece, monster, and step up. So, yeah, it's kind of bad. It really is. You got three chests right here. I mean, when you get the jackpot, of course, you're going to have, like, the, uh, what's it called? You're going to have the, um double chance so you have a really really significant since there's only three chests you have a really significant chance of over and over and over and over again getting the jackpot but still it's it's ridiculous it's legitimately ridiculous like you're going to be in a rotation of two spawns either way or you're going to be able to do one spawn and get it right away but still it's it's a big ripoff like if you do the monster spawn right the monster spawn for 70 gems you getting a 34 just like this one if you haven't looked at the list it's 34 and 35 costs guaranteed within here some of these monsters don't have awakening so 
I guess you might have a better chance of getting them here, but still, I wouldn't recommend it because in the monster spawn, it is 70 gems. You're getting at least a 34 cost, just like this spawn guaranteed. It is 30 gems less, and on top of it, it's going to have two potential awakenings unlocked. This one has no potential awakenings unlocked. But since it has two unlock of potential awakenings, it's going to be at UR as well. So you don't have to worry about getting these monsters at SSR and they get it having to go for the two uh, wind or water or fire or dark orbs or whatever orbs you need to go for. Considering that the ordeals only come out during certain days of the week, which is really annoying because that means you got to wait and wait and wait possibly and what's so not and upgrade these monsters and what's not they already have that all within the monster spawn legitimately 30 gems less and it's going to have two unlock potentials right away that is a really good discount compared to this legitimately like this one's going to be 100 gems and you might you legitimately might not even get it within your first try you might have to do two spawns before you get two monsters guaranteed 70 gems monster spawn you will only be able to do it twice yes but at least you're guaranteed with the spawn to get monsters <laughs> and on top of it they offered all that like i said if you need pretty much to know like i can i can explain in a separate video i have in the link below i've already made these videos how hard awakening is to really do the materials and what's not to obtain it and what's not if you really need to know how much of a discount that is and stuff like that but yeah they offer that and not just that if you like the ssr feature gear piece for the special spawn first time half off it's 15 gems and then from there it's 30 gems you are not guaranteed just like the treasure spawn to get the monster within your first spawn but with the ssr feature gear piece you will have significantly high rates to get 35s and 34 cost monsters within there i don't really recommend the monster spawn the monster treasure spawn they came out with whatsoever the concept of a monster treasure spawn is cool, but they completely destroyed it. Like, personally, I think the, um, having the metal exchange to get the summoning scroll of your choice would be a lot better than having, like, 2k in the jackpot and then 1k in the side chest, because that means there's an opportunity to get 3k within 30 gems. Not guaranteed, but if there's a high opportunity, and you're just gonna be getting medals really quickly. You legitimately are. For a fair price, considering these monsters are now easy to get, but on top of it, if you want the stats, it would make sense to use a little bit more gems to actually obtain that. But yeah, that's pretty much what I gotta say about the spawn. Thank you for tuning in and thank you for watching, and I hope this helped out. This is the Azraf, that I catch you in the next video. Also, pay to win. Pay to win. You're gonna be using a lot of gems for this. A lot of gems. Um, not to get just to straight up mods. Well, yeah, pretty much, especially if you're free to play. I know how hard it is to obtain those gems. It, you might need to do this legitimately like you like the bare minimum for like the first time half off only 150 gems for a monster dude i i don't like i don't recommend it whatsoever stick with the monster spawn please stick with the monster spawn but yeah th that's it for this video and i'll catch you in the next video i'm out Peace.